In this video, we're gonna talk about how you can expand your graduation theme designs for your Etsy print-on-demand business. All right, so why graduation as something to focus on? Well, there are a few different reasons. Besides the obvious one, that it is obviously just a general sales opportunity for your business, there's kind of more than meets the eye to graduation when it comes to the sales opportunities. So the first specific reason why I like creating graduation theme designs is because the season, the selling season for graduations is longer than some other holidays that come at the same time of year or around the same time of year. So think Mother's Day and Father's Day. And so they occur in the same time frame that graduation occurs. However, the shopping season for those two holidays is relatively short. Whereas graduation events are staggered throughout the second quarter, really, because you have graduations occurring in May for some schools and institutions, and you have graduations incurring in June for other schools. And so the shopping season for graduation gifts is quite long. Now, when I said it more than meets the eye, what I really was talking about was the niche opportunities. Just as an example, if the only thing you focused on was what is the person graduating from, you have super young ages, you could go all the way down to preschool graduates and make designs on toddler size, you know, t-shirts and things like that. You've got high school graduates, you've got college graduates, you have master's degree graduates, you have medical school graduates, nursing school grad. So you get the point. There's just all of these different levels of schooling and different specializations of schooling that you can actually create designs for. And that's, that's the tip of the iceberg. So we're gonna use Everbee to get a few different ideas within those categories that I talked about, just to, to get the ball rolling for you in 2024. So we're gonna start with a very general search term on Etsy of graduation gifts, and we're gonna use Everbee's Chrome extension to help give us some ideas of what types of products are going to be top selling products in this super general search term for graduation gifts. And then we, from there, we're gonna get a little more specific and see if we can find out some, some better, maybe lower competition ideas. So I'm gonna pop open my product analytics from the Chrome extension here. And the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to sort this by the monthly sales column. I could also use the filters here to actually set a minimum or maximum monthly sales that I want to see, but I like to just hit that sort because it's super fast. So we're seeing these sorted now by estimated monthly sales. So our top sellers are at the top. And what we're looking for are things that are, could be print on demand products that we could potentially look further into a niche for. So right away, Top three things here estimated at 400 sales per month is this personalized bag for nursing school graduates. So if we pop open this actual listing here, we'll see the details. So what we've got is a stethoscope with a heart design and then the person's name in it. And it is a fairly generic tote bag, but they are offering a couple of customizations here. So definitely this is the type of thing that there are plenty of tote bag and other style bag options available from print on demand platforms. You could certainly offer personalization of a product just just like this. One thing I really like about Everbee's analyzer tools, if you're looking at an individual listing like this, you could go to the Chrome extension or you could just click on the analyze listing button there to get back here. And the tag analysis I find very helpful because you'll see all the tags that this listing is using along with the search volume for the, the tag and the competition level. This can be very helpful for identifying just the search terms, you know, or the niche that you're interested in pursuing, but also really helpful if you are running out of tag ideas for your listing. If you wanna find some new tags to fill up those 13 tags, Everbee's tag analysis is really helpful for that. For example, look at the bottom here, nurse tote bag, an average search volume over 300 times per month, and the competition is around or just under 10,000. All right, let's go back to the general search here and look at a couple more. So some more trends that we see here, a lot of these, this is a graduation money holder that it looks like it's personalized. We have a personalized candle. This is actually a humor, this is a funny gift. So this is kind of like a joke gift. This is one thing. There are print on demand candles available from a couple of the major platforms like Printify now. So you could certainly get into selling candles that are print on demand with humorous labels on them like this, if that's something that you're interested in. 
There are even greeting cards and our, a lot of the platforms also offer greeting cards for sale. So this is another option that you could get into. I see yard signs here as well. And these we're getting down into the less than 100 monthly sales, but we are just getting into graduation season at the time that I'm recording this. It is April 24th right now when I'm recording this. So sales volume on some of these things will increase over the next couple of months. Here's just another idea. Again, this is a product we can get from print on demand platforms, these yard flags. So this is something that you could definitely create some designs for and offer personalization with the graduate's name, something like that. This would probably be a, a really good one for high school graduations, college graduations. But again, you can offer different variations of that very easily. So I think I made my point here, even just with a very high level general search like graduation gifts, we're finding some products in the top sellers for that search, which are print on demand available type products. But let's get a little more specific and see if we can get a couple more ideas that uh, won't be quite as general. For example, let's say that you sell a lot of mugs or maybe you even have a mug only print on demand shop. So I'm gonna search for graduation mug and we'll see what we get there. So again, I will pop open the analytics and we'll take a look at the monthly sales for the top sellers. But here's an example of a mug that is selling quite well that here's an example of something that is much more specific. Let's open this individual listing and take a look at it. This mug is a humorous take on graduation from the perspective of either you're graduating with a PhD or graduating with an MD. It could be either one because it just says doctor. But this is not just your typical generic 2024 graduate type design. This is very specific to somebody graduating with a doctorate and it's also humorous. So if we take a look at the analytics on this one, we're looking at currently 82 estimated monthly sales. It's around 11 months old in general. Again, the sales volume being that it's still April, we're not quite into like the full swing of graduation season. So that probably will tick up over the next couple of months. And if we look at the tags they're using, there are some nice looking opportunities here. If you look at PhD grad gift, we've got over 200 monthly searches. 7,000 competition. Now, as you can see, this one is also personalized. So you could adapt this design to not be personalized if you're not interested in selling personalized designs. But if you're open to doing personalized designs, then that just broadens your opportunities. All right, let's go in one other direction because as I mentioned, one thing you can do is target parents of graduates, not just the actual graduate themselves. So I put in mom of graduate as my search term. Let's pop open the product analysis and see what is selling in this niche. We're gonna see some common themes here, except if you noticed, one of the things we didn't see in the very top sellers for those other searches that we just did was apparel, really. We weren't seeing a whole lot of t-shirts, sweatshirts for those other searches. But now we're gonna see a little bit of a difference here with the mom of graduate search. So what we've got is some listings that actually are still personalized, but they're t-shirts or other apparel. Here's a couple with over 100 monthly sales. Here's one actually with exactly an estimate of 100 monthly sales. Let's take a look at that one. So this is a personalized design, but notice what this seller is doing. They're offering multiple variations for the whole family here. You've got proud sister, proud cousin, proud dad, proud mom, proud uncle, the name, and you can even, the customer can provide a picture that gets put right in the middle in the zero there of 2024. So a very personalized design. Now let's take a look at the tags that the seller is using for this one here. We're probably gonna see some fairly high competition tags. Yep, we sure are. Graduation gift with 900,000. But if we start to look down the list here, we'll see some that are lower competition. We've got graduation family with a little bit lower competition and but very high search volume right now. We see graduation 2024 with very low competition right now. That'll increase, I'm sure, but that's quite low considering um, you know we're almost in the season. This one is already selling up to 100 times per month, and that will likely increase over the next couple of months. And if we scroll down a little bit, we're going to see more examples of kind of the same thing. Here's one that we're down to roughly around 30 estimated monthly sales, a similar type of design. This one is proud mom of class of 2024. And again, there's a picture in there and custom text for the name and the school. So another variation of the same type of design. Let's just check the tags quickly here and see if there's anything unique. Insert photo shirt as a tag is a very interesting phrase to, to use here because the search volume apparently is very high and the competition is not bad. 
creative choice there, and it's probably paying off for them. And just to give you a very quick idea of how quickly I would dive into a niche, like the one we found about the uh, the humorous doctor mug, one thing I noticed on that one is there didn't have a graphic element to it. It was text only. So I decided to go in a different direction and use some type of graphic. This was generated by Kittle AI. All I did was put in a prompt of a stethoscope with a cap and gown and used the mascot style. And this is what it generated. And I'm using a very similar phrasing here. And I would be doing personalization of the name and then eventually personalization of the year. I would update this for 2025. And I could also sell, and I could also put this one on a t-shirt or a sweatshirt as well. It doesn't have to just be mugs, but we saw that example as a mug. So here's just a quick look at that finished listing. I've got my primary thumbnail here with little text so that people know this is a personalized item. I've got all of my mockups from Printify here. My personalization field I turned on to let customers give me the name that they would like on their mug. And I've got all my tags here, which I did get most of them from Everbee. So there you go. That's just a quick variation of that finished design. And of course, I could do a quick variation of this by getting rid of the stethoscope and changing it to more of a PhD doctor version as well. I could offer that variable within the same listing, or I could just create a second listing. So that'll do it for this video. I hope you picked up a few ideas to get the ball rolling on graduation theme designs for 2024 and beyond. Don't forget to subscribe to the POD Insights channel. Thank you so much to all subscribers. I do appreciate your support. Thanks, everybody. See you next time.